Welcome back everyone, it's Starian from Asterian Gaming here. Today we're running the second wing of Black Rock Foundry, which is known as the Black Forge. Now the second wing is actually the left entrance way in the main hall here. Now as you see, I, I took out the first wing of Slag Works, these are all gone, the all the ads. But since we're here, I also wanted to show you the new transmog I got from getting that one piece of gear that dropped from the last video. Kind of look like I like the way this looks with the transmogification of the weapon and shield too. But other than that, let's get into it. Now I see there's an elevator here. Looks like I missed it. For some reason, you won't take fall damage from falling down to this elevator all the way to the floor. I don't know why. It's probably the one elevator that you won't die from fall damage. Our first boss here is Hans and Franz. Or Ronzor and Hansgar. Hey, Franz! Franzog! We got a jam! So, go on jam it then! I ain't on jamming it! I unjammed it last time! You wanna tell Black Hand we got a stamper that ain't stamping? Hey, you! Get in there and unjam that stamper! <laughs> yes, this patch will have some impurities. Now, to actually get this boss fight ready to start, you have to take out the Azadur. Eight ads, pretty simple. As you can see, there they are. Now, as you can see, they actually have pump up and makes their damage and abilities go up. But uh, let's bring up their little menu here. Now, there's actually environmental threats you have to be aware of. But we'll go over the abilities here. All right, let's get in the final. Let you see how this goes. I am out of range. Your bones will be crushed to dust. I'm going to take you down. I see their HP is shared. As hands is taking damage, so is Franz. So. And as you can see, the bear belts move. I'll be back. You can just jump onto the side here. You won't bother by that, but you'll have to avoid these plates coming. Achievement not get hit by those, so I'm, I'm not sure if I have it, but hey, I can see you could easily use this to get make up lost ground to move forward. So you can't always use the little rails here, you call them the dodges, so you have to. 
wonder why I was going slow. I got dazed. <laughs> Here comes the stampers. Apparently, I yeah. Uh, come come the forge I'll up be to back. overdrive. Got hit. You gotta avoid this chaos. <laughs> Wait, ah! you you think that was me? Just wait. Back then, you'd be stuck here and be like, you screwed. <laughs> so you gotta be aware not to get caught by these. Hear me now, and believe me later. No, not like this. Did you just get crushed? Dang. Alright, well, there's Hans Tron. And now you can backtrack, go another way, or you go forward and go through here. Either way, it still gets you to the same room. Now you can see this is their assembly line. Pretty much my group's back in the good old looking for raid and normal. We just hop up, just go straight instead of going around. Now you got two blade here, it's more of a mini boss for this one. Now this boss is interesting here. As you see, there's an ad. Anark Steelbringer. Now, if you keep him alive and kill Flamebender, he will join your side and you'll have a new follower for your garrison. We're gonna bring up the Flamebender, Kagras. Here's the abilities you need to be aware of. My work. You've interrupted my work!
feeding time. I recruited myself a new follower. Which is good. Woo! Scream Savager, Grease Monkey. Oh, those are quest word bonuses. Oh, I love this one already. Strength. So you simply just gotta take her out without killing him, and you get a new follower. Now, the abilities you saw I got, those are lucky ones for quest rewards. They could vary on your own experience. I just got lucky that he had Scavenger and Grease Monkey. Now this is the final boss of the wing here is Krogmog. Now if you remember in the first video, you see the incisions on his hand. He was the one summoning up the earth spikes on the first wing of Slag, of the Slagworks. So here we go, let's go over there, this big guy's abilities.
Now, as you can see, that happened because I didn't get grabbed by one of those hands. So, unless you're a mage with slow fall, rogue with safe fall, or a druid that goes into cat form, you're probably not going to survive that fall. Oh, don't forget about the paladin with their bubbles. But I wanted to show you that. Now we're just going to light this son of a gun up and uh, end the fight. Now we just got to wait for the respawn. I'm sorry. <laughs> There's the entrance. Down you go. Ogundro, Andro, Duka, That beast was irreplaceable! Where are the attackers now? I want them dead! Dead! Now. Black hand's getting a little angry, but uh, this has been a staring from the staring gaming. Asking to please hit that like and subscribe button. And also, go check out my Twitch channel. I try to stream almost every day of the week if I can. And other than that, I'll see you all in the next video.